14 Things Women Should Never Do Again Sometimes, it's good to be a quitter. As we move through life, it's crucial to shed the old habits, mindsets, and behaviors that no longer serve us. Society often places unnecessary expectations on women, and the pressure to conform can weigh heavily. But it's time to break free. Some habits deserve to be left behind for good, and it's not just okay. It's necessary for your growth, happiness, and well-being. Here are 14 things women should never do again. 1. Try to change your body to fit the ideal body image. Let's face it, societal beauty standards are constantly shifting. One decade, curves are in, the next, it's all about being lean and toned. Instead of chasing an ever-changing ideal, celebrate your unique body. Stop torturing yourself with diets, extreme workouts, or expensive treatments just to fit into a mold that's not yours. Your body is your home, and it deserves to be loved and respected. The media's portrayal of beauty is often unrealistic and unattainable. You are already enough. 2. Apologize when you don't mean it. Women are often conditioned to apologize for things that don't require an apology. How many times have you said sorry when someone bumped into you, or for expressing a valid opinion? It's time to stop apologizing for simply existing. Apologies should be reserved for when you genuinely feel remorseful, not as a default response to any situation. Take back your power by standing firm in your actions and words, without feeling the need to say sorry all the time. 3. Ask permission for things you're already entitled to. Stop waiting for someone else to give you the green light to pursue your dreams, express your thoughts, or even take up space. You don't need anyone's permission to live your life on your terms. Whether it's asking for a raise, going on a solo trip, or deciding to change your career path, understand that you are in control. Take ownership of your decisions and trust your instincts. You know what's best for you. 4. Try to save others. The urge to be a caretaker is natural, but it's not your responsibility to save everyone around you. Whether it's a friend stuck in a toxic relationship or a partner who refuses to change, you can't fix everyone's problems. Trying to save others often leads to emotional burnout, and it doesn't guarantee that they'll change. Instead, focus on your own well-being. Offer support, but don't take on the burden of fixing someone else's life. 5. Look for happiness in someone else. This is a big one. Many of us have been conditioned to believe that happiness lies in a perfect relationship or someone else's validation. But the truth is, happiness starts from within. When you rely on someone else to make you happy, you give them control over your emotions. It's time to reclaim that control. Cultivate your own joy, passions, and sense of self-worth. A relationship should enhance your life, not define your happiness. 6. Play small. Too often, women shrink themselves to make others feel comfortable. Whether it's at work, in relationships, or even in social situations, playing small serves no one, especially not you. Don't dim your brilliance or hide your talents just to avoid intimidating someone. Step into your power, embrace your strengths, and take up as much space as you need. The world needs your voice, ideas, and contributions, so stop holding back. 7. Stay in a job or relationship that makes you miserable. Life is too short to stay in situations that drain your energy and crush your spirit. Whether it's a dead-end job or a toxic relationship, you deserve better. Staying out of fear of the unknown or because it's comfortable isn't a reason to stay stuck. It's okay to walk away from situations that no longer serve you, even if it feels scary. You have the strength to start fresh, and often, the best opportunities come when you let go of what's holding you back. 8. Be satisfied with unsatisfying sex. You deserve to feel fulfilled and satisfied in every aspect of your life, including your sexual experiences. 
settling for mediocre or unsatisfying sex because you're afraid to communicate your needs or desires is a disservice to yourself. Your pleasure matters. Speak up, explore your body, and know that your satisfaction is just as important as anyone else's. Never feel ashamed to ask for what you want in the bedroom. 9. Dress your age. The idea that women should dress their age is outdated and limiting. Who decides what's appropriate for any age anyway? Fashion is about self-expression, not about conforming to societal standards. If you love bold prints, bright colors, or edgy styles, go for it. Don't let anyone tell you that you're too old or too young to wear something you love. Your personal style is just that. Yours. Embrace it without apology. 10. Feel guilty for not wanting kids. Motherhood is a beautiful journey, but it's not for everyone, and that's perfectly okay. If you don't want to have children, that decision is entirely yours and doesn't need to be justified to anyone. Society often pressures women to conform to the traditional roles of wife and mother, but you are free to define your life on your terms. Don't let guilt or outside opinions force you into a choice that isn't aligned with your true desires. 11. Base your self-worth on your relationship status. Whether you're single, dating, married, or somewhere in between, your relationship status doesn't define your value. Society often places an unhealthy emphasis on being in a relationship, as if being single means you're lacking something. In reality, your worth is not tied to whether or not you're partnered. Embrace your independence and know that you are whole and complete on your own. 12. Stay silent when you want to speak up. Your voice is powerful, and you should never be afraid to use it. Whether it's speaking up about an injustice, expressing your opinions, or defending yourself in a tough situation, staying silent only serves to suppress your true self. You have every right to be heard. Don't allow fear of backlash or judgment to keep you quiet. Your words can create change, inspire others, and most importantly, set you free. 13. Compare yourself to other women. Comparison is the thief of joy. In the age of social media, it's easy to fall into the trap of comparing your life, body, or success to others. But what you see online is often a highlight reel, not the full story. Focus on your own journey, celebrate your progress, and understand that everyone's path is different. You are unique, and comparing yourself to others only diminishes your own achievements. 14. Put your needs last. Women are often praised for being selfless, but constantly putting others' needs before your own can lead to burnout and resentment. It's not selfish to prioritize your well-being, it's essential. You can't pour from an empty cup. By taking care of yourself first, you're better equipped to help those around you. Make self-care a priority, set boundaries, and never feel guilty for taking time for yourself. Conclusion. It's time to embrace a new mindset and leave these outdated habits behind. As women, we often carry the weight of societal expectations, but breaking free from these behaviors will lead to a more fulfilling and empowered life. Let go of what no longer serves you, and watch how your world transforms. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comment section down below, and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end. Also make sure to check out our next highlighted video, and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.